You have challenges. NASA has research and innovation to help. Microparticles are commonly used as a seed material in wind tunnel testing to measure the airflow velocity, biological testing, and histological staining, among other applications. This is challenging due to the large level of background noise arising from reflection of incident light off the surface of the model being tested. Thus, the ability to seed the airflow with the material that can be used to accurately portray the airflow properties, such as minimal particle lag, while enabling near-wall measurements with improved signal-to-noise ratio, is of high interest to wind tunnel researchers. Researchers at NASA Langley Research Center have developed a method of generating dye-doped polystyrene microspheres using novel synthetic approaches. These particles will have great utility for wind tunnel measurements near the wall where the state-of-the-art seed materials are of limited utility. Additionally, the incorporation of these dyes will offer other avenues of data collection, including temperature and pressure of the airflows in wind tunnel regions. Likewise, the ability to selectively filter the data collected from these dye dope polystyrene microspheres can have further applications, including the direct visualization of two or more fluid flows mixing, among other applications. NASA's Technology Transfer Program ensures innovations developed for exploration and discovery are broadly available to the public, maximizing the benefit to the nation. To learn more about how the method of making dye doped polystyrene microparticles technology can help with your product development, email lark-techtransfer at mail.nasa.gov.